All right, Coach Andrews. Yes, sir. We're here on a Saturday. We're wrestling on a Saturday. And what are we wrestling? Women's wrestling, girls Women's wrestling, wrestling. Yeah. state of Ohio. Yep. Tell us about it. Uh, you know, so I think this is an awesome thing. State Coach Association's <laughs> pushing to get a girls' state tournament. We're hoping that in the next you know, year, two years, that is sanctioned by Ohio High School, and it starts by doing events like today. You know, Belt Pound put on a great event. I think they had over 140 girls registered. You know, we got teams like Orange just got a full team. We got 10 girls, nine girls today. Uh, a couple other schools have got nine, 10 girls, and that's how you build momentum. All right, so nine, 10 girls, you took second, right? All right. And this this is kind of billed as a lead up to the state tournament, a mini state tournament, if you will, right? Yeah, how do you think you did? Uh, I think, you know, we had a couple girls come away with uh, first, couple seconds, couple thirds, you know, in the end, if it's just like the, uh, the boys' state tournament, right? Like, you got to win those close matches if you want to be at the top of the end. And, I think it's a valuable learning experience for our girls. I mean, most of them have only been in, I think this is their third tournament. Some of them only one or two tournaments. And so there's something to put them together, two and three and four matches in a row. So you can't do it without experiencing it. So that's, that's what we're working on today. Valuable mad experience. But one thing I know about the, the community of Marysville, they've always supported wrestling. You have a tough program from the little guys and gals and actually – Always had female wrestlers in the in the little. Uh, uh, yeah, as far as I can remember. Yeah, we only had a couple in our youth program. Um, this last year we had uh, a couple girls. That they call themselves the OGs, the original girls. Um, that they really got this thing started. And I think we had, we had five last year, and then we came in this year. We had seven, and then Old and George had their event, and some girls said, "Hey, wait, you can wrestle other girls." And we picked up five more, and a couple of those dropped off. But I think it's just that type of uh, momentum is going to take what it's going to be what it takes, you know. And it's going to be conscious effort at the youth and middle school levels. So it's not just starting at the high school level every year. So let's dive a little bit more into that, right? It's not just a game of numbers. I, I'm not trying to say that it's only about numbers because we do have personalities yeah. involved yeah. there. But you said you had a handful and you lose a couple. What are you doing to, to kind of recruit uh, from from your position in order you know, to see this thing grow? I'll be honest, you know, I'm, I'm envious of what Coach Nicole's got going on over at Orange because he's a dedicated person that's completely devoted to that. You know, like, you know, I won't be shy about it. My, my primary role is to do the best I can for our boys program. And, you know, and, and I almost did a disservice to the girls for a little bit because I wasn't actively recruiting enough. And then I just kind of decided, we decided, if we're, there's no ha doing this halfway. So if we're going to do it, let's do it. So then we started targeting girls that are in CrossFit, girls that we know are athletes and other sports, you know, girls who've been, who've had siblings who've wrestled or been stats or been around it. And just say, hey, come give it a try for a week. You know, we try to work some things out where we wrestle a duel on Thursday. So let's have a girls only practice right after school for, for, for an hour just to work on some basic stuff. So, you know, I think the, the real momentum is going to come this spring, you know, we're going to take the girls that are doing it right now and have them kind of lead a uh, intro to girls like every Monday, you know, and really do a hard recruit. Um, you know, I love the momentum that's going on. I think there are challenges um, that people haven't even thought about yet. You know, when you think about your facilities and your you know, how you schedule tournaments and where you, how you develop coaching staffs and those types of things. So I'm excited to meet those challenges head on, but there's certainly new opportunities. Well, meeting those challenges comes with support. What kind of support are you getting from the community? Community-wise, I think um, I think people are. So I think they're supportive of it. Uh, I think the more that they get the opportunity to see these girls on wrestling against other girls, it takes away some of the stigma, right? So I think that that's why we're all in on trying to get to these events so that um, we can showcase where our girls are, you know? Um, I think our, our school district is kind of like Ohio High School. It's a wait and see approach. Like, hey, get the numbers, show us that you need this and, and then we'll support it. But you know, like we're having a duel against Old Changey Orange on February 12th. Um, you know, our AD was good, great with that. Our, our, you know, we were able to move some things around with, with basketball schedules to be able to get the gym. And you know, they're not opposing it. It's just, it's like, it's like wrestling. Right? Wrestling people got to do the work to, to show that it's there. And I think most people are willing to do that. Well, good. I'm glad you're you're showing support for this. I mean, you're a wrestling guy through and through, right? Who, who oh, yeah. else? Who else to do it but you? Well, you know, and that's and I'm fortunate. You know, I get, I get to serve on the state association board, and, and so we kind of saw this coming a year out. You know, and so I think, especially for our girls who did it last year, there was a little bit of a dangling care to say, hey. You know, last year you went four and twelve wrestling JV matches. This year there's going to be something that's a little bit more specific to you, and I, I think that built some excitement for some of them. Some of them maybe were on the fence about coming back. So I do think that this will be the momentum, just like we see across the country, right? We see when when people get on board and they realize what it is, it just like spreads like wildfire. So I would expect nothing less than the state of Ohio, and that's what we're hoping in, at Marysville. Well, congratulations to you. I look forward to seeing what you're doing here. I already built it up, taking second place today. Yeah. You got a state tournament coming up, so yeah. we'll see how you do there. Yeah, Anything uh, uh, from your from your your past will tell me that you're going to do a fantastic job, oh, I'm sure. You. I appreciate it, Rob. All right, thank you. Yep.